You or a family member have been injured by medical malpractice and you're wondering what the process of bringing a claim will be like. Hang on for a moment and I'll explain the fourth step in an Indiana medical malpractice claim, the selection of the medical review panel. Hi, I'm Guy DiMartino, a Northwest Indiana medical malpractice lawyer and author of A Patient's Guide to Indiana Medical Malpractice Claims. The medical review panel has four members. The chairman, who is an independent lawyer, and three doctors. The specialties of the doctors on the panel will depend upon the issues in any case. For instance, if the claim has to do with the fact that in an emergency room doctor misdiagnosed a patient with a heart attack, the medical review panel may have two emergency room doctors and one cardiologist. If the attorneys get along and can agree upon the specialties, the medical review panel process can be simple. However, sometimes there are disputes about the medical specialties that should be represented on the panel. The medical review panel has one doctor appointed by the patient, one doctor appointed by the healthcare provider, and many times the third doctor will be decided by the first two doctors. The panel chairman is active in choosing the panel, and he or she convenes over the panel when it meets to decide the case, but the panel chairman has nothing to do with the decision. The law requires that the medical review panel come up with a decision within six months of its formation, but this deadline is typically extended. If you would like to learn more about medical malpractice claims, you can click the link below and request a free copy of my book. I am Guy DiMartino meeting you at the intersection of law and medicine.